Hello everyone and welcome to today's session on IoT Architect Career Path by IntelliPath. An IoT architect sorts through all the data transmitted between networks from various machines and gadgets used every day by millions of people. IoT architects help organizations fix business problems designing IoT solutions. They are also responsible for creating and communicating the IoT concept, message, and architecture. In this session, you will know all about the career prospects of an IoT architect. But before we begin the session, make sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so that you'll never miss any update from us. Why become an IoT architect? Learning curve for IoT architecture, job prospects, job scopes and salary ranges, sample interview questions, and finally, future of IoT architecture. Now let's go to our first topic. Why become an IoT architect? The Internet of Things is a network of physical objects or things embedded with sensors, softwares, and other technologies to connect and exchange data with other devices and systems being through Internet. Architecture is the most important Important component of any software discipline, not only IoT. Code and other factors follow in second. The architecture defines what the final product or feature or improvement will accomplish. If the overall vision isn't clear, rushing right into coding will only make things worse for both the engineers and the client who expects the result. And thus, quite literally almost all major industries and companies are exploring more and more of IoT. With that, IoT architects automatically become integral parts of those companies and industries as well. The IoT industry is growing at an incredible 24.7% compound annual growth rate. And big name firms like Google, Cisco, Microsoft, Dell, Apple, and Facebook, among others, are significantly investing in IoT applications. Certifications do go a long way too to help you land your dream IoT architect job. So here are some of the most renowned IoT certifications that will increase your chances of getting that job. The Microsoft Certified Azure IoT Developer course, the Articura Certified IoT Architect course, AWS Internet of Things Foundation Series course, and finally, the Stanford Internet of Things graduate certificate course. Now, let's look at our next topic, learning curve for IoT architecture. Every technology or skill has a particular learning curve associated with it. Hence, let us take a good look at the ones that's most suited for IoT architecture. We will now discuss the basic level of knowledge that is required for IoT architecture. Let's start with the basic requirements in terms of knowledge and skills. IoT data management practices. The continuous learning about IoT business and data governance, which is a collection of processes, roles, policies, standards, and metrics that ensure the effective implementation of a certain something. That is required of an IoT architect. This training is required not just to attract new companies, but also to avoid unforeseen outcomes, communication, and leadership skills. A strong knowledge of IoT data governance and excellent programming abilities would still be insufficient for an IoT architect. They must have excellent communication and leadership abilities, as well as the ability to interact with a wide range of individuals. Expertise in technologies. Some IoT architects may be programming specialists who employ open source data management systems such as Hadoop or who are fluent in many programming languages such as Java, Ruby on Rails, Python, CSS, HTML5, or the SQL. Others could be hardware specialists. While specialized technical knowledge might be beneficial, an IoT architect must understand the technologies to use in solving an IoT business challenge, as well as their strengths and limitations, how to use them. And finally, develop apps as projects. Doing projects that will add weightage to your portfolio and resume is something that everyone who aspires to become an IoT architect should start doing. So some of the best applications or project ideas for IoT and IoT architectures are smart agriculture system, home automation system, face recognition boards, air pollution monitoring boards, and health monitoring systems. Now, let's take a look at our next topic, job prospects for an IoT architect. Let's look at some of the job prospects for an IoT architect, such as the daily works involved, typical sectors in which they get placed into, the scope, and the general requirements specified by the mass hires. Job responsibilities of an IoT architect. Manage the IoT vision and technological strategy development. 
the IoT architect must collaborate with key business and IT executives to create an IoT vision that defines corporate goals and communicates that vision to the key stakeholders. A portion of this comprises recording the company's important success criteria, and another part entails using the company's value to motivate the employees. An effective IoT vision is rational and intentional, not just aspirational. Next is construct end-to-end -end IoT architectures. The IoT architect must determine and define the organization's IoT target state, as well as an ensuring target architecture will meet the current and future business needs. An end-to-end -end IoT solution usually covers a wide range of technical domains from edge data collecting sensors, equipments, or appliances through integration with business applications and systems. Next one is enable the design and construction of IoT solutions. In the design and execution of IoT solution, the IoT architect collaborates with and supports solution architects. The architecture is important, but it's not the only thing IoT architect has to offer. IoT architects provide lessons gained and design knowledge from their diverse portfolio of deployments. Create a process to build IoT solutions. The goal here is to develop and standardize a process for designing IoT solutions and then to guide that process's growth and improvement. Because these projects will follow a methodology that includes the organization's expertise and collected best practices in IoT solution development, it will make the production of IoT solution easier and more dependable. Finally, collaborate with diverse enterprise groups to deliver value. IoT connects physical business operations with back-end processes, bringing together IT and non-IT organizations such as business units and operational technology OT teams to define clear business objectives for IoT solutions and ensure that they interact smoothly with existing processes, the IoT architect must successfully communicate with teams across this must successfully communicate with teams across the enterprise. Now, let's look at a few skills that the companies are looking for. Master IoT products and solutions, familiarity with various business solutions, programming languages such as CSS, HTML, Java or Python, previous projects in app development, data analysis and data utilization. Now, let's go to our next topic, job scopes and salary range. Let's take a quick peek at some of the companies who are in great need of IoT architects as of now. Companies such as Siemens, Qualcomm Technologies, Tech Mahindra, Robert Bosch, Qcom and Honeywell are some of them. Now, let's look at the average salary ranges. In India, the average salary ranges for an IoT architect ranges from as much as 14 lakhs per annum up to somewhere around as much as 40 lakhs per annum. Let's look at our next topic, sample interview questions. Here are some of the most frequently asked basic questions during the IoT architect job interviews for fresher. So let's take a look at them so that you can crack those interviews the next time you attend them. Explain the characteristics of IoT. What are the different components of IoT? What are the advantages of IoT? What are the challenges or risks associated with IoT? What are the different types of sensors in IoT? Explain how IoT works. Explain the term smart city in IoT and explain sharding. The next topic is future of IoT architecture. The internet is always developing and changing. Human-to-human -human contact is the primary mode of communication on the internet nowadays. The IoT may seem as the internet's future evaluation that enables machine-to-machine -machine or M2M learning. As a result, the internet of things connects everyone and everything. The Internet of Things, IoT, embeds intelligence interconnected items to allow them to interact, share information, make choices, take actions, and deliver incredible services. The IoT is gaining traction in academia, business, and government with potential to provide enormous personal, professional, and economic advantages as well. And since IoT architecture will be relevant as long as the Internet of Things exists, it's safe to say that the future of the IoT architect job surely looks bright. Thank you for watching this video and make sure that you're subscribing to our YouTube channel and hitting that bell icon so that you'll get all the updates. Just a quick info guys. IntelliPath is providing hot training mentored by industry experts, the course link of which is given in the description below.